Juniors into line. So they're just about set to go. Steve Alstada puts the green light on. Lure in motion. They're set for race number 10. The white dog on the inside is the favourite. Ready? Racing King Baroque begin okay. Fast out Hurricane Junior will lead though from King Baroque and then Rollo followed by Nayskip. Then came City Girl further back to Bacono, Dark Amber and Sublime Cody. King Baroque the favourite hit the front of length clear. Here comes Nayskip with a rattling run followed by Hurricane Junior and Rollo as they turn. King Baroque the leader. Nayskip can't get there and King Baroque got home to beat second. Nayskip perhaps from Hurricane Junior followed by Rollo and Bacono. Back behind them was City Girl followed by Hurricane Junior and Sublime Cody. 22-9 the race time and King Baroque wasn't best served. Took a little while to uh, put the afterburners on but he got through it on the inside. Hit the front and draws away. 22-92 the time. For a fleeting chance I thought Nace Giff was going to put himself right into the race coming to the bend but he just got off the track on the corner. One from six. We are standing by for third. It's a much tighter go. 676, 1189, 1103, 2292 PB. And interim placings of 1, 6, 2 and 4. Hurricane Junior third, a Rollo ran fourth. Winning margins 2 and 3 quarters. A nose between second and thirds. Interim 1, 6, 2 and 4. King Baroque for Justin King. Successful here, the favourite by Seneki. A more Baroque at start five, win two. He's owned by John Tyndall and trained by Justin King. A light brindled, brindled dog whelped in October of 2021. Second goes to Greyhound six, Nay Skiff to Nathan Old by Aussie Infrared, Effective Spirit. And two, Hurricane Junior into third placing, Darren Ward. Good odds, Harada, Miss Serena. 1624 on race 10. So there's the result, 1624, two and three quarters by a nose, 22 and 92. Up next, race 11 in 12 minutes, she's airborne, Marley M. Grand at 380 a pair. We go over the 520. And all clear on the previous, 280 and 160, 180 and 180.